a platform that ditched LangChain entirely because it was slowing down development. Bold move or self-sabotage? Let's investigate. DeFi is an open source AI app builder competing against Langflow and Flowwise. Think visual drag and drop for building chatbots and AI workflows. But the competition is absolutely nuclear right now. Langflow just got acquired by Datastax with massive corporate backing. Flowwise is stuck at 30,000 GitHub stars since September. DeFi, 58,000 stars and climbing fast. A comprehensive comparison tested all three with complex workflows. Diffy offers just 15 components, while Langflow and Flowwise throw hundreds of Langchain objects at you. Sounds limiting until you realize those hundreds are basically duplicates with different labels. PDF load versus file load versus document load. Chaos dressed as features. DeFi's approach is surgical. 15 components that actually do different things. The variable system flows data seamlessly between nodes without restrictions. Meanwhile, Langflow users Google which of their 17 embedding options to use. Flowwise doesn't even have loop functionality yet. The debugging experience separates contenders from pretenders. Diffie maintains complete logs of every test you've ever run. Time travel through workflow versions and examine what broke three iterations ago. Nested workflows? Diffy logs parent and child workflows automatically. Langflow shows execution times but can't track previous versions. Flowwise has basically no debugging tools. <sighs> Building complex AI without debugging is surgery in the dark. Stability tests revealed patterns. Flowwise performed reliably but lacks features. Langflow had connectivity and image upload problems during testing. DiFi ran smoothly throughout. The founding team came from Tencent DevOps, and that enterprise experience shows. Pricing is interesting. FreeTier gives 200 OpenAI calls to test without a credit card. But here's the plot twist. You can self-host everything for free. Competitors use MIT and Apache licenses, while DFI's more restrictive license prohibits building competing services. <laughs> Fair trade for the feature set. Community growth tells the story. September to January, DiFi jumped from 40,000 to 58,000 GitHub stars. Langflow grew 30 to 42,000 with Datastax money. Flowwise stayed frozen at 30,000. The market is choosing. If you're building AI apps and hate wrestling with duplicate components while competitors ship products, DiFi might save your sanity. The learning curve is gentle, debugging is professional grade, and it actually works. Subscribe for more deep dives separating hype from substance. Which platform are you betting on? Hey, Mark here. So look, I spend a lot of time investigating these products. And honestly, I'd rather not fill this channel with sponsored content from companies whose products I might end up roasting next week. That would be <laughs> awkward. If this review helped you out, saved you from wasting money, or maybe helped you find something that's actually worth buying, here are a few ways you can support what we're doing here. First up, I've put the link to this specific product down in the description. If you want to check the current price or read more reviews, click through there. And if you do buy through my link, they toss me a few pennies without charging you extra. Win-win. Second option, and this one's for all you regular Amazon shoppers, there's another link down there that just goes to Amazon's homepage. Bookmark it, use it whenever you shop. Doesn't matter if you're buying this product or just restocking on toilet paper. Using that link means a tiny portion of what you're already spending helps fund these investigations. And trust me, Jeff Bezos won't even notice it's missing. <laughs> it's the easiest way to support the channel without spending extra money. Now the third option is for those of you who need help right now. Like, you've got a product sitting in your cart and you're thinking, is this thing legit or am I about to waste my money? That's what our membership is for. Think of it like hiring me as your private BS investigator. For as low as three bucks a month, you submit products for urgent investigation, I do the deep dive, and deliver a personalized review to your inbox in 24 to 72 hours, depending on your tier. It's basically like having me on speed dial for product research. Except, instead of calling, you just send me the sketchy product, and I'll tell you if it's worth your money or complete garbage. All right, that's it. Keep questioning everything, and I'll see you in the next investigation, where we figure out what's actually worth your money and what's just expensive garbage with good marketing. Stay savage out there. Catch you next time.